way he wants to heal. Mm. And if it means laying on of hands, I think that that too is a point of contact. Mm. Uh, you remember the woman who uh, was bowed down for 18 years? Mm -hmm. And uh, he laid hands on her and she straightened up. Now people will criticize because there was a hypocrite there mm -hmm. and said, you heal her on the Sabbath day? Mm -hmm. And Jesus says, well, you'll water your animal on the Seventh mm -hmm. day. <laughs> and I can't heal this daughter of Abraham on the Seventh day? Mm -hmm. So, yes, he laid hands and, and that healed her. Mm. But then there were other times that uh, he just spoke the word. You remember the centurion? Mm -hmm. uh, he said, uh, the centurion said, you know, I'm a man under authority. Yeah. And all you have to do is speak the word. See, Jesus meets us according to the way we are and the way we understand. Mm -hmm. So he spoke the word and that centurion's daughter was healed. Mm -hmm. We have healing me mechanisms built in us. We are healed sometimes we don't even know it. We don't know why. Mm -hmm. Isn't he a good God? Mm, yes, he yes, is. Yes. <laughs> Absolutely amazing. Yeah, yeah, amazing. He touches us at where we are because yes. you, you talk about African people that they don't think at all like Americans. Yes. You oh, know, and, and he touches he them. Touch, he touches, touches them and talks to them. And yes, he absolutely does. Absolutely amazing. Uh -huh. When I was, may I say this? Sure, go ahead. When I was in Russia mm -hmm. and I was in the back of this huge building, they have buildings uh, bigger than, than I've seen here. Mm -hmm. And this young man comes up to me in the back and he's trying to say something and I didn't know what to say, but I do pray in what they call uh, another language. Mm. And so I started praying that mm -hmm. way and he took off and ran to the front of the room, contacted the others and there was some j jubilee going on. I don't know whether I was talking his language, oh my goodness. but Jesus is awesome. Yes, he is. Yes. <laughs> Absolutely and so he, he could have healed him. How do I know? Who knows? Who knows? He's miraculous. And He's miraculous. Beautiful. And this show has been miraculous for me. Thank I hope it's been good for you. Oh, yes. Yes. You've, yes. you've yes. received yes. healing. Yes. You've been uplifted. Yes. Yes. You know what? We have like three minutes left. Oh, Can you imagine the time has gone mm -hmm. so fast? But before we go, we want you just to give a word and, and just some closing remarks, some, some words of wisdom for our viewers as we go. Well, I, I'd like to, to share with our viewers the importance of establishing a relationship with Jesus because of the fact that we are living in the last days. Uh, Satan has stepped up his attack. Mm. Uh, he comes to kill, steal, and destroy. And you've got to realize that uh, God is giving us time to really get ourselves together because Jesus is going to return and we need to stop playing church. Mm. We need to stop playing and get right. Be we need not be like the uh, Sadducees or the Pharisees and we need to be real and right with the Lord and the Lord will use whomever, whenever, however he so chooses. Yes. And so um, my um, philosophy or I, I, I minister to the lame, the limited, and the lost. Mm -hmm. And I was in all of those positions at, at one time. Well, you're going to be the last <coughs> word. You don't mind, do you? That was a blessing right there. Yeah, right. In. She's going to be the last word because we got one minute. I really appreciate you mm -hmm. coming on the show. And we're excited. We hope mm -hmm. that you'll come back. We'll have a part two of oh, right. Women in the Ministry. Bless and you. to our audience, our viewers, thank you for being with us on our show about Women in the Ministry. And we hope we get to see you next time on Africa's Vision Network. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Well, very well. Praise the Lord.